From today, an injunction is in place to stop anyone gathering to race or perform stunts in cars, motorbikes or quad bikes on the streets of Birmingham. The new powers mean it's not only drivers who face prosecution, but also those organising and attending car cruising meets, which sometimes involve hundreds of spectators. Councillors today condemned the dangerous practice and promised to come down tough on those breaking the law. Chris Halpin reports. This is drag racing Birmingham style. Hundreds gathering here to watch cars dangerously speed on the A47 Heartlands Parkway, risking their lives and also their cars. By day, this is an arterial route around the city centre, but by night, cars can race up to speeds of 100 miles per hour. Out of town dual carriageways like these, with roundabouts at either end, providing a perfect circuit making it an ideal but potentially lethal illegal racetrack. But from today, new powers have come into force to punish not only the dangerous drivers, but also those who organise, promote or just attend the car cruising meets through a citywide high court injunction in place for the next three years. We will fine them up to £5,000. Uh, we will uh, prosecute, uh, we will take their vehicles off them, we will uh, crush those vehicles and my message to them is quite clear whether they're prosecuted on the scene or not we will use all our resources whether that's CCTV whether that's intelligence information from our communities to ensure that there's, an, um, there's a crackdown on anybody using vehicles uh, inappropriately. And this tough stance is already being taken in other parts of the Midlands with injunctions in place in Solihull since September and across the black country since February last year all to ensure there's no place on our streets for recklessness like this. Chris Halpin, ITV News, Birmingham. The daughter of former